Welcome to this new episode of Grammar Made Easy. If you're new to our channel, be sure and subscribe. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you have any questions, leave a comment below. Today, we're going to learn how to talk in the past using the passato prossimo and imperfetto. Let's start with the imperfetto. There are two situations where we use the imperfetto. First, we use the imperfetto to talk about habitual actions in the past. Da bambino andavo spesso in Spagna con la mia famiglia. When I was a child, I often went to Spain with my family. Da giovane giocavo a basket tre volte alla settimana. When I was young, I played basketball three times a week. Da piccolo non mangiavo mai la verdura. When I was little, I never ate vegetables. We can also use the imperfetto to describe people, things and situations that happened over a period of time in the past without specifics. Let's look at an example of each. First, people. In passato ero timido. I used to be shy. Second, things. La macchina di Luca era blu. Luca's car was blue. Finally, situations. Ricordo le feste di Anna. Tutti ballavano e cantavano. I remember Anna's party. Everyone danced and sang. Now, let's see how to use the passato prossimo. First, the passato prossimo is used to talk about actions in the past that happened one time or a specific number of times. For example, Dieci anni fa sono andata in Spagna, in vacanza, con la mia famiglia. Ten years ago, I went on vacation to Spain with my family. Ho giocato a basket una sola volta nella mia vita. I played basketball only once in my life. Da piccolo ho suonato la chitarra due volte. When I was young, I played the guitar twice. The passato prossimo is also used to speak about specific actions in the past that happened in a short period of time and are now finished. For example, Questa mattina ho mangiato la frutta per colazione. This morning I ate fruit for breakfast. Due ore fa ho chiamato Franco. I called Franco two hours ago. The passato prossimo can also describe an action that happened over a specific period of time. Ho avuto due cani dal 2010 al 2018. I had two dogs from 2010 to 2018. Now, let's look at some examples of how to use the passato prossimo and imperfetto in conversation together. Mentre facevo colazione, sono arrivati i miei amici. My friends arrived while I was making breakfast. Qualcuno ha bussato alla porta mentre dormivo. Someone knocked on the door while I was sleeping. Mentre guardavo la TV, mia sorella mi ha chiamato. While I was watching TV, my sister called me. Thanks for watching. I hope you like this video and don't forget to follow me on Facebook and Instagram at Italian Lessons with Flavia. So ciao for now.